In this video, I want to show how 357 connects with 666 using a case-sensitive cipher of Gematria as well as binary numbers. I'm going to talk about my inspiration for this video and I'm also going to show, possibly going to show a couple of additional examples. Some of what's on my mind, I gotta say, is next level stuff, and I don't really have the time to explain it, probably in this video. So we'll see where this goes. But let's just start with this. So this morning, I saw a video, a number file video, and the presenter was Simon Singh. If you watch my videos recently, you know that I talked about Simon Singh, and how he talks about some hidden mathematics in the episodes of The Simpsons. Well, I later found out that he also talks about hidden math in episodes of Futurama. So the video that I saw this morning, I'll leave a link in the description box, but Simon Singh talks about this episode called The Honking. In this episode, the robot character, Bender, he is to inherit a haunted mansion, but the catch is that he has to stay overnight in this haunted mansion. So the him and the him and his friends, they stay in this haunted mansion and spooky stuff happens. But one thing that happened that caught the attention of Simon Singh was that there were numbers in blood on the wall. What looked like blood on the wall. And the numbers are binary numbers. They don't explain that in the episode, in the Futurama episode, but he, Simon Singh, breaks it down. He says this number that shows up, 01011001101, is a binary number, and it represents 357. Now, he, he says that's not particularly interesting, and even the characters in the show don't find it particularly interesting, but then Bender, the robot character, looks over at a mirror, and he sees the reflection of these numbers, the numbers backwards, 101001110, actually represents the number 666. It's the binary representation of 666. And as soon as I saw that, in the middle of this video, this number file video, I knew there was some more connections with 666. So one of the first things I did was I typed out the words 357 and I used all lowercase letters. Using all lowercase letters with the reverse Frank Baconis cipher. Again, that's a case-sensitive cipher. The words 357 equals 666. Now you're writing out the words, not the digits. But again, the words 357 equals 666. And I will point out that's reverse Frank Bacona. So how appropriate. Especially we're talking about these numbers that are seen in reverse. These binary numbers. 357 in binary. In reverse. Looks like 666. And I used all lowercase for the words 357. But watch this. If you... Use the mirror reflection of those letters. If we do 666, okay, we're going to type out that word. But if we use the mirror reflection, so you see how the S is completely backwards. That S has no value. The I does, the X does, the H does, the U does. But the N is backwards, so that doesn't have a value. The backwards D does not have a value. The backwards R does not have a value. The backwards E does not have a value. The backwards D has no value, the backwards s no value, but the rest have value. You can see the cipher breakdown. In this particular one, we're using the case sensitive cipher reverse Francis Bacon. 666, all capital letters, all capital letters, 666 with the mirror reflection equals the 357. And I, I have shown in previous videos that I have deleted, but in previous videos that this reverse text is very legit and you can see the cipher chart down below and up the top you can see the breakdown the word 666 backwards 
you can see just under each letter what the value is and which the letters that are missing that don't have value are the backwards letters that do not appear as normal letters. Gematronator does not recognize these backwards letters. But yeah, in all caps, 666 gets us that 357. And then if we use the reverse Frank Baconis cipher, again, that's reverse Frank Baconis, the words 357, all lowercase letters, 357 equals 666. And again, the binary representations are mirrors of each other. So in a nutshell, that's how... 666 connects with 357. I'd love to hear and see in the description box some comments with some more examples of how these numbers connect.